and welcome back to Most Amazing Top 10, I'm Rebecca Felgate, and today we're talking about the top 10 animals with full time jobs. These flufters are pulling in a serious wage and good for them, although I feel a little bit weird about it in some cases. Before we launch into this video, I just want to remind you guys that we have an Instagram and you should absolutely follow us. Also, if you want to pick up something cool to wear in the new year, we also have merch at mostamazingshop.com. Okay, back to the animals. Coming in at number 10, we have internet star Tada Sauce. Tada Sauce goes by the stage name Grumpy Cat. Grumpy Cat became a meme in 2012 when Brian Bunderson posted an image of her on Reddit, sending it viral. Grumpy Cat now earns a living for her owner, Brian's sister Tabitha, and she now also has a whole team behind her. She has over 2 million Instagram followers, a website, a YouTube channel, merch. Put it this way, Grumpy Cat makes more money than most people watching this video. And a heck of a lot more than the lady hosting it, trust me. Grumpy Cat looks the way she does because she has feline dwarfism, which actually makes me feel really sad about her being a meme. She's so cute. Coming in at number 9, we have Water Skier Twiggy. Twiggy is a squirrel who can water ski like a pro. Footage of Twiggy's skills have gone viral on YouTube as she showed off her talent on the GoPro YouTube channel. She often appears at boat shows and sometimes on television. Twiggy is actually several grey squirrels trained to water ski. But each of them are good earners, booking many public appearances and media appearances. When each squirrel is retired, they live out their days as squirreling pets. I think I'd like a pet squirrel. 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 Coming in at number 8, we have coal mining canaries. This is a traditional job for a canary, but the story behind it is pretty sad, although luckily most canaries no longer pull this kind of 9 to 5. Back in the 20th century, when coal mining became a popular practice, a lot of human workers were killed when poison poisonous carbon monoxide gas was released deep in the mining caves. A solution came when they were able to detect the gas coming, but in the days before efficient detectors, canaries were taken into the mines for protection. You see, canaries are naturally very chirpy and make a lot of sound, even though their lungs are much smaller than humans. If the miners ever heard that the canary had fallen silent, they knew that it was time to get out. Coming in at number 7, we have Model Bodhi, the Shiba Inu. Bodhi is a 7 year old dog, often referred to as as the menswear dog. Bodhi makes 15,000 US dollars a month, which I need a second to just even comprehend that. Whew. It's even crazier when you think that he banks all this cash by being a menswear model, which has traditionally been a job for humans. He has modeled for many designers and many events, and has appeared at New York Fashion Week. Oh, and he has a book, which is a pretty incredible achievement for a dog. You can follow Bodhi on Instagram at menswear dog, and I'm following him now, and He's cute. Not cute in your usual menswear model kind of way, but just in a, ah, dog. Okay, so as we are around the middle of this list, let's step away from the crazy for one second and show some love to dogs out there whose full time job is to help people see. Coming into number six, we have guide dogs. There are 10,000 seeing eye dogs in the United States alone, and these dogs are trained pretty much from birth to be able to assist the blind with their everyday lives. If you do want to know more about what they do, then we've done two collaborations with the beautiful Molly Burke on Most Amazing Top 10. I know from hanging out with Molly and Gallup that Gallup works really hard when he has his harness on, but when it's off, he's just like any other dog. Coming in at number 5, we have Police Constable Tizer, the Railway Cat. Skimble Shanks the Railway Cat, just me, just me. Good. So Tizer was the first in a line of police constables and was adopted by the British Transport Police to work at a North London railway station. PC Tizer roams King's Cross and keeps it as rodent free as can be. Inspector Roy Sloan said that he is an essential member of the team and the pair even share an office. Say hello to the lawn mowing llamas who work at Chicago's O'Hare Airport at number 4. In 2012, a team of llamas were taken on by Chicago O'Hare International Airport. This was in order to provide a sustainable way of keeping the grass trim. The reason they are so important isn't just simply actually to keep the grass from growing tall, they also keep other wildlife away from the tarmac. I don't know about you, but I love a good llama. I went on a llama trek once and it was like the best day. Coming in at number 3, we have Magic the Horse who is a therapist. This horse is a therapist. I guess, kind of, sort of. Magic the Therapy Horse visits patients in various hospices, hospitals, families and first responders. She is one of a number of gentle carousel therapy horses, a charity that brings comfort to those that need it most. Magic went to visit one patient who had not spoken to anyone in three years. The moment she saw her, she broke her silence by saying, isn't she beautiful? 
Also, perks of the job, sometimes being a therapy horse allows you to dress up too. Look how fancy magic is in this picture. Nay! Coming in at number 2, meet the dolphins who are in the US Navy. The US Navy actually has a bunch of military trained marine life including sea lions and dolphins. On top of that, the Russians now have also employed combat dolphins. What? In fact, to be honest with you, military aquatic life isn't new. They were used in the Vietnam War too. There are a range of jobs in the Navy for dolphins. They can protect military bases and ships. They can also swim pretty darn fast and have sonar abilities. This means they can detect mines deep down underwater. I'm just saying that sharks with frigging lasers on their head don't seem so ridiculous now, do they? It's just a matter of time. Maybe World War 3 will be fought with dolphins with lasers. I don't know. Finally, at number one, meet Mayor of Sun Old California, Bosco. Bosco is a black Labrador retriever and Rottweiler cross. Sadly, Bosco is dead now, but this beautiful pooch was a politician. He was mayor of Sun Old for 13 years until his death taking office in 1981. Bosco defeated two candidates winning over the electorate. While he is no longer with us, the Sunnel residents have erected a statue in his honour and that is still there today outside the post office. I hope that he serves as an inspiration to all other aspiring mayor mongols. Who let the dogs out? Who? 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 I will take any opportunity to sing that song. Any. So that was the top 10 animals with jobs. Hopefully this list goes to show how awesome animals are and I really hope that nobody abuses their good nature. So I for one do love animals. If you love animals too, let me know what your favourite is in the comments section down below. Also let me know if you have any pets and if you put them to work, which is actually kind of weird. For now guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure you give it a good thumbs up, share it with a friend and stay subscribed for more top 10 videos. Thanks so much guys for sticking around to the very end. If you want to continue with your top 10 binge, then why not check out the top 10 people who think they're animals and the top 10 animals who can talk. Bye.